Hey everybody, this is Rob with Flail Throughs, and today I'm Maelstrom, sitting in for Rob while he's recovering from his surgery and general illness. I decided to submit a few videos and send them to his brother so that they could be uploaded on the channel. After all, the show must go on. Today I am playing in a Zaku 2 Kai, uh, Fritz Helm type, in Maganak colors from Gundam Wing. I thought the colors really suited this suit and it's flat, high-raised Fritz helmet. Made it look real good, really reminiscent of what I was going for. I spent a lot of this match not using the machine gun, despite the fact that I really probably should have been, but I tend to close in for melee, which is just how I play. And thankfully, with two stunning sub-weapons, this suit does great at that. Now, I spent a lot of this round fighting this armor GM here, and... In general, when I see an armored GM with a bazooka, what it says to me is the enemy player wants to play the meta, but be exempt from the negative side of everyone else playing the meta. Which, I use my experience to lock him down. Right now my legs are out, but since this is a simple battle, I'm able to kneel and do some recovery, which gets my legs back. Unfortunately, I'm not able to capitalize on this. Before I can line up a shot with my Sturmfaust, I decide to try to position, and I get killed by a grenade. Thankfully in this round, I actually ran into a player I trained on this game one-on-one -on -one a few times. That Ifrit DS over there being chased by the entire enemy team. And he did great this round, literally saving me multiple times. And I couldn't have asked for more. Very proud to see the progress he's made since I sat down and taught him how to play the game. That goof there did an extremely good job this round. There was a nice stun on that armor GM. Um, I have not seen a goof in quite a while. Generally, it's still a great suit. It actually is probably one of the harder hitting raids, but just it's been power crept, so it's not super popular. So when I do see one, I'm pretty impressed when they do well. Even I dust them off every now and again, but have a pretty hard time. Unfortunately, I was just countered there, but what can you do? Overall, I like this Saku. I probably should have ran it with the bazooka, but for the theming, I am doing quite a few suits in Gundam Wing inspired colors this week, and with a number of machine guns to be honest because most of the wing suits generally had rapid fire firearms nice little roll around the corner there unfortunately my two ifrit teammates there happen to knock each other over but as the round's going on if you notice our score's actually been rather close the entire round the enemy team did a great job on this match and Unfortunately, I'm about to die from that very goof I mentioned earlier. Yep. He's got, I believe, the Earth Federation EFF on his shield. Nice little touch. But I decided that having a nice Gundam Wing theme, just because all the new players coming in, a lot of players are probably reminiscing over Gundam Wing, hoping they see suits in here, and while that's extremely unlikely, Nice little downswing there. Um, I just wanted to show that you could use some paint and some creativity and recreate quite a few things just for fun, honestly. Just for a little fun. Upper class senpai doing a great job there. Backing him up with my own weapons. Unfortunately, I stole the kill there. Wasn't trying to. Just trying to keep that suit on lockdown since I knew it wouldn't interrupt him with the attack pose control or assault system? I don't remember the term right now. But as you can see, me and him have some pretty good synergy. Once again, stunning that GM who just... He thinks... A lot of people who run the armor GM think that just because you're using the suit, it means you can't be stunned by bazookas, which is far from the truth. Just means that it's a lot harder, but somebody with a good shot's just gonna hit you anyway. We're down to a minute left in the match, and we're still pretty much neck and neck with the enemy team, unfortunately. Though, we just scored two kills there. 
and all of our team appears to be mostly alive other than our support. He was a great support for this round. We probably should have supported him a little better. But as I said, I also probably should have been using the machine gun better. I was mostly sticking to the two uh, stunning sub weapons. And uh, things worked out. Unfortunately, I don't manage to save our support here. But and I'm about to flub into something in a very classic. I recorded this, I plan to show it to people, so of course something stupid's gonna happen right at the end. Style. Right there, I actually did some work with the machine gun. Unfortunately, the Efreet DS is down. It's just me, the support, and our other Efreet. I'm going in to back him up. Managed to get in, knock down perfect distance on that downswing. Another downswing. However, I don't get a chance to roll, don't get a chance to really retaliate for the rest of the round but by this point there's nothing they can do and once again upper class senpai seals it with a nice kill all in all a nice fun round had some fun using a suit i don't use with weapons i don't normally use i'm normally a raid player but i took top diversions upper class senpai did a great job with the score and damage I didn't do too bad myself. A couple kills, decent damage. But that's going to do it for today's flail throughs. I hope you had a good time watching, and everybody take care. Later! So if you're seeing this video, that means that Rob and his brother have signed off and have approved.